So, Intruder, an independent short from 2021. I heard about this short because I know they were going to make it. And I know the people behind it, too. I have worked with them and the Caledonian community players, especially the director, Walt Hast. Or Haste. I don't know how his last name is pronounced. Sorry, Walt. Anyway, Walter. He directed several plays of his own. Well, not several, but two. One was in 2017, Lyle Lyle Crocodile, when I was playing Mr. Grumps. The other he directed was in 2022, A Jolly Brown Christmas, at the, uh, at the Black Box Theater. I feel so isolated in that, and claustrophobic. Now I know what frogs and mice feel like in that box. Now he and I worked together the second time, to be fair, in 2019. That was in Christmas. He wasn't a director, but he was one of the stars. A singing star. We both did the Broadway Christmas Cabaret. And if you saw my review on that, you know how much I kind of despised it. Wait, no. This short film was shot in Caledonia, Michigan, in collaboration with the Caledonia community players. So instead of doing theater work, they're trying to do independent filming. And Walter served as editor, director, and, and cinematographer. While Devin Foote, who I work with in Lao Lao Crocodile, was the writer. Now, sad to say, yours truly was not cast in this story. Even though I auditioned. But Walter replied back, I don't think this might be the kind of film that you should do, Ben. So I took what it's worth. And then when I finally saw it at the party, hmm, I can understand why I was not needed. So for this 2021 short they made, well, it's kind of a new experience for them. What? 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 You didn't know the local theater group made a short movie? Why, sure. Well, it's not a new thing to try now, but it is an experiment. So what's so great about this movie? Well, two people I know have worked on this. One person I started with before, the other two never heard of. So let's just dive right in and check out Intruder. <laughs> Intruder. Wait! Oh, but before I forget, I want to make this very clear. There's another short called Intruder, and a miniseries that's also called Intruder. Ironically, they came out in the same year as this Intruder did. This cannot be just ironic, it's a coincidence! A sudden, unexpected coincidence. And for Walter and Devon, I don't think they even know about this. Of course, I don't blame them. I'm not going to blame them for doing this in 2021. They probably don't know about this. So I'm going to be on their... So I'm going to stick to that conclusion. They don't know about it. It's not ironic. They're my friends. They're not stupid. Well, except for these two guys. They're both stupid. So yes, here's the movie. We begin the short at a house that's for sale. And inside this house, there's a bit of a dark history. A mysterious gunshot lets people know something happened there. Wait, no. <laughs> and one title card later, we see the salesman again. The realtor, that is. This time trying to sell his house. The place. Uh oh. What are you doing in my house? Get out! 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 It's the ghost of a long dead hippie. Or is he a beatnik? And now, because I don't want to leave these guys behind, it's time we meet the cast of the short. All four of them. And here they are!
desperate and determined to get this so-called person out of the house, which may be a phantom or a spirit, or maybe a homeless squatter. Yeah, they didn't say who this guy was. All of a sudden, he just came out of nowhere and she sees him. What the hell? I can't. I've heard the rumors. I've seen the news. I, th I thought I could for the price, but no. Anyway, he makes a phone call to get some serious help. That's interesting. I've never heard about that before. Desperate to get that ghost out of the house, he calls upon the local whisperer. A ghost whisperer, that is. And she knows exactly what she's doing. And what does she look like, you ask? Well... How long this is going to take? There she is. Who are you going to call? Ghostbuster! This man, who is named Eric, is the main target. He has an incident that we'll see what happened later on, just before the end credits. I'd... But I'm going to stop right there. Because I want to show you something even more important. Before the short was made, Walter put up a behind the scenes look of the short that's going to be made. The cast will be there, the crew will be there, and he filmed it and posted it, uploaded it on his Facebook page. Take a look. All right, patrons of Caledonia Community Players, this is Walt coming live to you from the set of a short film we're doing called Intruder. So in this room, we have the cast and crew of Intruder. Hi. <laughs> Production assistant, the writer, Devin Foote. Tell us about the show without giving away too much. It's about movies. It's about movies? No, it's not. No, no, it's not. What, what's the, give a brief synopsis. A brief synopsis is that basically someone is trying to sell a house that is already occupied. That's where I'm going to keep that secret. Ooh, spooky. And then, of course, returning is Kelsey McKay. Glad to have you with us. You guys excited? Yeah. We're going to premiere this movie on the 29th of October at the Family Tavern during our Hall or Back from the Dead Halloween Gala. Tickets are $10. Uh, you can buy them at the door. You can buy them in advance. There's raffles, prizes, a cabaret. We're going to premiere this short film. It's going to be great. We hope to see you guys there. 29th of October, Family Be Tavern. Do it! 7 p.m. Be at the gallery. Be there. How do I end this? They were so determined about the short, no matter what was to be made. <laughs> I like his enthusiasm and energetic spirit. You gotta give him credit for that. And now for her, Lydia, I am not making a Beetlejuice reference, decided to tell this ghost, Eric, that it's time to move on. Of course, to him, he has no idea that he is, well, no longer living. Now that's the kind of actress that would scare the dickens out of anybody. And she can place a curse on anyone instantly. She looks like that kind of actress, too. In fact, 12 years ago, she put a bad curse on my friend, Ben. Take a look. Jeez, now my arms are buried. Ain't this freaky? Ugh. But an open wound to the chest reminds the ghost that he was murdered in that house. I thought that was a bad dream. And she knew about it. And before he departed from the world, he said this. Just tell Robert one thing. What? I forgive him. But you won't forget. Zoo, motherfucker! Zoo! Quote the raven, nevermore. And just before she left, she told the realtor how awful he was to him, and realizing that he, what he did was a federal crime. But did he get arrested? 
Did he commit suicide for what he did? We don't know exactly. It just ended. Ah, oh, but it's not completely over yet, my friends. We got two minutes of bloopers. <laughs> ah, why would you do this? That was so bad. I you have invaded my personal space. A great menage for your dancing, I will give it that, but personally I would have gone for something much more better. Like instead of that song, we could use this. That's pretty much it. That was pretty much it what I have for Intruder. But it's not over yet. They premiered that short in a gala tonight. The fight of the night or welcome back to You know, I think I can post this up. Yeah, that's what it is. And I got some footage to show you of the dancing celebration that night. Although unfortunately I can't say I can't show that much because there's copyrighted music and some. But, since I'm an editor, I can mute all that and replace it with a different music. And it goes something like this.
Song's ending. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. We need another song! Yep, so that's my review on Intruder. I gotta admit, this is different. Not great, not too surprising, not wow, so that's just different. An experimental kind of different. It worked with me over time after a few rewatches, but for now, I'll just say, great job guys, keep it up. That's pretty much all I can say, it certainly got me, got my attention a lot. In the meantime though, if you have seen the short, what are your thoughts about it? Is it good? Is it bad? Is it, eh? Well, that's totally up, that's totally up to you. So there you have it. That's my review on Intruder. I don't know if they're going to continue these shorts or not, but I hope they do. I'm actually starting to enjoy watching them. Well, there's only one now, but there will be soon, someday in the near future. And since I'm a writer myself, maybe I could pitch an idea or two to them. But we'll see what happens. I'm Big Bad Ben. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. And it's getting late. I'm going to bed. <clears throat>